Christmas came early this year. Now, as I'm sure most of y'all know, cause I've said it at least 4,736 times by now, your boy here is full time on YouTube. I don't know how many times I've said it. I don't know how many videos I've said it in, but I, can, I can't stress it enough that I am full time on YouTube making reactions that don't make any money. Literally like 99% of all videos on my channel demonetized. So I can clearly say thank you. Uh, <coughs> thank you to everybody that's on Patreon for allowing your boy to go full time on YouTube. And you and your money and direct support are the reasons why this channel is still going. So because of that, any type of monetary decisions that I make for the channel, y'all are always the first ones to know. And boy, oh boy, did we make some monetary decisions. Now, as you may know, like whenever I decided that I was gonna do the Patreon thing and see if I can, you know, sustain full-time income, like it's all well and good. I love Patreon. I love I love that everybody stepped up and allowed me to do this, allowed me to pursue this dream that's kind of once in a lifetime, you know? The dream was threatened by corporate America and that shit felt really bad. It felt like it felt like a symbolic moment for everything that corporate America stands for and everybody that and everybody that kind of they're forced to go into that world because they weren't able to they weren't able to pursue pursue what they're passionate about. And whenever I made that video, a lot of people that were the comments that I got on Patreon and in DMs like, yo, I, I gladly support what you're doing because I didn't have this opportunity. I didn't have the opportunity to potentially say no to a nine to five in the way that you do. And I want you to live your dream in the way that in the way that I wish that I could. I'm living vicariously through you. And that's the kind of shit that made me emotional, that I was like touching souls. It was more than just reactions. And while I love everybody who contributed and everybody who still contributes, if you're watching this video on the day it came out, if you're watching it two, three weeks later, you are still a part of the channel, but the people who supply the money for the channel always get to see the things that we buy first. Having said that, I, I from the very beginning, I always wanted to, I always wanted to be able to not rely 100% on Patreon for my income. I'm trying to find ways to, di to diversify revenue away from what I do on YouTube because because you never know who's going to come in and win on Patreon, who's going to drop out on Patreon, how fast they're going to drop out, how long they're going to keep the support there for. So it's still very up in the air in terms of what can, what I can expect. So one of the things that I had been wanting to do and everybody on Patreon and on YouTube, everybody knows for the most part that I want to potentially stream, whether it be stream reaction, whether it be stream chilling, whether it be streaming video games or streaming video games with subscribers, like, and then from those streams, clip them and highlight them and make highlight reels on a separate channel so that way I can actually monetize those things while we still keep the reactions available on this side. Now, one of the biggest hurdles whenever it comes to like getting into the streaming world is, is having the right equipment in order to do streaming in the correct way or in the way that it was intended to be. It takes a lot of computing power in order to even do what you're doing on the computer, much less take that, take what you're doing and stream it out there constantly. It takes strong internet. It takes an extremely strong computer. It takes good microphone in order to make, in order for your stream to sound clear. And all of that costs, costs money. And one thing you need to know about your boy right here is that if I'm gonna do something I'm gonna do it fully right and, and I'm gonna go boss to the walls basically my my motto in life is go big or go home when you have the opportunity and boy oh boy did we go big and if you aren't a patreon subscriber that's completely fine I don't want you to think like you don't have a hand in this even if you're subscribed on the YouTube channel only maybe you don't maybe you don't believe in, in giving money to, to, to creators maybe you don't have the ability maybe you're in college or maybe you're a student or maybe you're not 18 and and you're just not able financially to be able to give money that's completely okay I care about y'all just as much as I care about the people on patreon because y'all directly have a hand in the people that even see the link to patreon y'all subscribe to the channel y'all like the videos y'all leave comments y'all interact with me that helps the algorithm like I say at the end of every video and then the algorithm catches somebody's eye and then that person is potentially able to like the channel and subscribe to patreon the third fam is family regardless of how you support boom right there but yo, I decided that I was going to do a little bit of unboxing. I, the only thing that we don't have here yet is going to be the actual computer rig. That's going to be a separate video all on its own with stats and everything. But we got all the accessories for stream. Oh, shit. Almost fell right there, 100% almost fell. But we got the accessories for a stream, baby boy. And we're going to open this and we're going to do a little bit of unboxing. 
Merry Christmas, third fam. Now, if I'm being 100% honest with you, I completely forgot what I ordered from Amazon. This secret labs box is obviously a, uh, I don't know if obviously, maybe, maybe you're not in the gaming world, but that is a very nice gaming chair. It's a very nice computer chair. And that's gonna be the last thing that we open because that's the thing that I'm most excited for. But like I said, on Amazon, the things in the packages, I completely forgot what those are. So it's your surprise just as much as it's mine. So let's get on into it. I'm, I'm happy, I'm excited. This feels like it's important. This feels like it might be audio equipment, but I'm, so I'm, I'm kind of upset that they packaged it like this with like no padding. But you know, it is what it is. And another box. Damn, they got me. Don't you hate that shit? Boxes inside of boxes? What's this one? And another box. Oh shit, okay. This is the cloud lift. Every major streamer that you see pretty much uses one microphone, which I'm assuming is somewhere in these packages, but it's the Shure SMB7 or something like that. But it is a microphone that needs a lot of power, and that's basically what this little bad boy is. It provides it provides gain. So that's all that this does, is provides power to the microphone. So boom, we got the cloud lift. I don't know what this one is at all, actually. Focus right, oh shit, this is the uh, this is the interface that the cloud lift goes to. This is the microphone interface. This, these, are, these are the things that added up over time as I was like per as I was buying the equipment for the audio I was like oh dope all I need is a microphone and a boom arm nah you need the cloud live and you need this bullshit you need XLR I'm gonna leave a link for all this stuff in the description below they're gonna be affiliate nah I'm just kidding I don't have no affiliate links and because I don't have no affiliate links I'm not about to go through all the fucking hassle of putting everything in the description below but what do we got next I want to assume because that's the that those are the peripherals for the microphone that this is the actual microphone itself I hope my address isn't showing on any of these boxes. That'd be kind of stupid, right? But I was correct, baby boy. Sure. SM7B, I think I said SMB7. Either way, this microphone right here was one of the biggest expenses on the audio, if not the biggest. This mic is like three, 399, 350 or something like that. I forgot what I paid for it. But Patreon, your 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 money is going to good use. That, that's the point that I'm trying to make with this video. Because this right here, this whole setup that we purchased, this is by far the most expensive thing that I've bought with the Patreon money. And I believe that it's going to good use because it's gonna allow me to expand the content that we make, you know? Now, since we are on a microphone streak, I'm gonna assume that this right here is the boom arm for the mic. But yes, I was correct. I was gonna buy the blue one, but why am I gonna spend all that money? I'm, we're starting out. This is the least of my worries when it comes to the microphone. If it's shit, then I'll just buy another one. And I say that as someone who's never used a boom arm and it's probably one of the most important pieces of equipment so the microphone doesn't move now that I think about it. <sighs> now let's talk about this bad boy right here. This is a gaming monitor. This was probably 300 bucks. I have another one coming with the actual computer rig. It's gonna be a dual monitor, full gaming system. Y'all saw the mic set up. The place that I ordered the gaming PC from is CyberPower PC. They build custom computers and ship them custom built. Now in in order to prevent credit card fraud because transactions get a little bit of expensive on that website and in order to prevent credit card fraud if you ship it to any address other than the address that matches your debit or credit card they have to go through like this whole process they got to call you why are you shipping it to a different address yada 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 I didn't want to do all that so I was like I'm just gonna ship it to my dad's house because that's the address that we have on file for my credit card now the reason that I'm bringing that up my dad has like a nine month old like German Shepherd like some type of big ass dog mix and he's a puppy and when they leave he tends to get a little anxious and self-destructive this monitor got delivered yesterday my dad brought it inside went to the store for 10 minutes and in that time frame in that 10 minutes this happened like, what the fuck? Dumbass dog, you know? We got 1920 by 1080. I didn't want to go with 1440 just yet. I wanted to have the lower, I wanted to have the lower latency. So this is a one millisecond latency, 144 Hertz monitor. Also 1440p and 240. I'm not gonna know the difference. I'm going I'm been a console player my whole life. I know 30 frames a second. So going to 144, that's gonna be mind blowing enough already for me. The monitor that I ordered with the computer is this same exact one. So I have two monitors basically at 144 Hertz. Now you're probably thinking to yourself, if you're a tech nerd, why the hell do you have 144 Hertz second monitor? You're just gonna be reading chat and running OBS. True, but go big or go home, you know what I'm saying? And matching. There we go. Ooh. Ooh. Now that right there, 
is one sexy piece of computer equipment. So I guess I'm part of the PC master race. Fuck consoles, you know? Nah, I'm just kidding. I'm still gonna buy the PS5. Woo! $300 well spent. Now this right here, this is the main event. Secret Labs, secretlab.co, Omega Soft Wheat Black. Now the reason that I say that this bad boy is the main event, because if you've been subscribed to this channel long enough, you know that every single video that is on this channel has been made sitting on this thing. And I figure after passing 100,000 subscribers, after quitting my normal nine to five job that I was gonna be making decent money at and going full time on YouTube, it's only right that I finally have a chair that I am comfortable sitting in. And as I was researching chairs, I was like, these things are mad expensive. They were all ranging basically from 200 to $500. And I was like, I haven't had a nice chair in three years. We're going balls to the walls. What's the motto? YOLO. Nah, that is the motto, but not for this. The motto is go big or go home. And this chair right here, we went big, $450. But it's supposed to last years and years and years. It's a one-time purchase type vibe. So let's get to opening and putting it together. Now, one of the things that matters to most as me as a consumer, especially when I'm spending hundreds and hundreds, if not thousands of dollars on something. One thing that matters to me, and it says a great deal about the company and how, and how much they are proud of their product is the packaging and what it looks like as you open. And right out the gate, I'm already getting good vibes. Your unboxing experience starts here. Not only that, the font is facing in the same direction. So you know that you're supposed to be opening it from this side. All right, the second flap has information on it too. Caution, do not touch backseat recline lever while removing from box and until backrest is securely installed. I'm assuming that's gonna be like some kind of like spring lever action, which will pop you in the fucking face if, if you do it wrong. So again, packaging matters. Again, packaging matters, people. I'm telling you, congratulations. You are now the owner of a brand new Secret Lab chair. I appreciate you, Secret Lab. Flip this sheet over and you will find a quick start guide to assembling your Secret Lab chair. We highly recommend you checking out our assembly video as well for even more detailed and visual instructions. This right here is tight. Yo, it's literally 12 steps to putting this bad boy together. And if you wanna watch the video, in my mind, I was already like, where do I get the video at? I'm, I'm gonna have to go search on their website. Nah. QR code, scan that bitch and watch away. This is what I'm talking about, people. If you are going to be charging out the ass for something, because in my mind, $450 for a chair is out the ass. So if you're charging out the ass for something, not only does the product need to be right, which I'm assuming the product is more than fine, and the reason I'm assuming that is because the packaging is right. Why do you think people love Apple's packaging? Why do you think Beats headphones like did research and development just for the packaging alone? The unboxing experience needs to be a, literally that, an experience. And so far, Secret Lab, mm, chef's kiss, 10 out of 10. Remove all the parts from the box while taking care to avoid Avoid the backrest recline lever and the back seat bracket. All right, so apparently this goddamn lever might kill me. Welcome to comfort. I don't know if you can read that. Let's open this, see what it's about. Secret Lab Access, it is sealed. That's so dope. The Secret Lab Access Pack. Aftercare guide, free two year warrant. Yo, this is dope. All right, man, I'm hyped for a goddamn chair. All right, so we're not touching the handle, guys, in case you didn't know. This is the back seat to it. That goes right there. I'm assuming the casters are in this box. Look at this. Packaging once again, people. This is the kind of shit that I get excited about. Jesus Christ. You just stick in there? That's simple enough. Boom. Base, assembled. Yo, look at this toolkit. Y'all see that packaging right there? I'm a sucker for packaging, if you can't tell by now. Super simple, nothing too crazy. Yo, know, in case you wanna know how serious they are about not touching that one piece, do not touch, caution, everywhere. Oh, I'm just moving this out of here because I feel like it's a bomb. Oh, shit. 
Like butter, baby. This thing, look at this. Somebody come look at this. Look, 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 look at this. Somebody come look at this. Look at this. Somebody come and look at this. This thing is nice AF ammo. The stitching, the Omega sign right here, this little detail right here, it's like the suede detail. It says 2020 when the when it was built. I paid $450 to be reminded how shitty 2020 was. Thanks, Secret Lab. Yo, I ain't even gonna lie to y'all. I'm still kind of scared of this thing. Let's do this with confidence. Confidence is key. Confidence gets you places in life. Do not remove this strap until the backrest has been securely installed. Bro, I think there's more warning labels on this chair than in my car. But I'm gonna listen though, because the warning labels are there for a reason. And that reason is somebody probably died putting this thing together. Maybe not died, but there might've been a serious accident and the company was like, oh shit, so now we don't have to pay liability claims. Let's just put more warnings. And I know what you're thinking. You're like, damn, that's cool and all, but it's gonna be exposed like that? Nah, fam. Magnetic brackets to make sure that it looks clean AF. All right. Finally, we're doing this. All right, here goes nothing. Is this gonna explode in my face? Look, you take the hex side, flip it over, boom, screwdriver. And it's a magnetic screwdriver at that. The bomb has been activated, I guess. Yo, there's mad tension in that thing, so if you pull that open too early, that shit would just fly at you. There's no wonder there was all those, all those, uh, all those warnings about it. And this goes in here, bam, like that. All right, ladies and gentlemen, here we go. The inaugural sit down. Boom. Yeah. Already, this is by far the best $450 I might have ever spent. Technically, $429.99 because shipping was free. Appreciate you, Secret Lab, especially considering this box was 90 pounds. That would have been a bitch. I know, I know in my head that the shipping is built into the price of, so it's not technically free, it's built into the price of the product, but that's fine. I'll take that placebo effect of thinking that the shipping is free. I would much rather pay $430 for a chair that comes with free shipping than $380 for a chair that has $50 shipping. It doesn't make sense, but it makes sense up here. But yo, everything about this chair, son, can you do this? It doesn't go to 180 degrees. But what the hell do I need that for, you know? But we got like this soft this soft fabric and then the accent colors, like this black right here, this black panel is like suede material, like I said earlier. The armrests move three directions. We got up and back and forward. We got side to side and then we got up and down. I didn't know until I started shopping for chairs, I didn't realize that movable armrests were kind of like a big deal. It's a premium feature. But yo, Patreon once again, like I keep on saying like, Everybody that's watching this, that's a Patreon subscriber, I appreciate you. You're the one that allowed, I've, I've spent 150, 300, 700, 450, all the accessories, the monitor, 300. I've probably spent close to like $1,500 and the computer isn't even here yet. All this is only possible because of Patreon. Everybody that's watching this as Patreon, I appreciate you. Y'all keep the thing going like I say every video. Everybody that's watching this as non-Patreon, I appreciate you even getting me this far by subscribing and commenting and all that. You might, like I said, you might not be somebody who's capable of doing Patreon, but your view, your comment, your like, your subscription pushes the videos out there to people who potentially are capable of doing Patreon. So you're doing your part just as much as the Patreons are doing their part. But once again, everybody that made it this far, I appreciate your time. I'm super excited for what the future is to hold. That is awful grammar right there, but you get what I'm saying. I'm excited for the future of the channel. I'm excited for the future of reactions, live streams, all of that shit. Who knew that I would be right here in this position and I'm only in this position because of y'all guys. But until the actual custom PC rig comes in, that's really all that I got for you today. Most of this stuff can't even be used till that comes in other than the chair. And I might set up the microphone for live, for live, uh, live reactions, that kind of thing. But I appreciate your time. Like I say, at the end of all my videos, go out there in the world, love and care for one another, love and care for each other. And I'll catch everybody on the next video. Peace. Ugh.